Okay, so now I put the chainsaw in here, and now I can fight enemies with this thing. <laughs> oh my god, this thing is nuts. Several buildings would be capable of performing <gasps> over 100% capacity if infused. The what? I can make everything run faster? Do I have any more slugs? <gasps> I do. I have more slugs than I thought. Oh my god, dude. Let's turn these into power cores. Let's make it happen, Captain. It's like every time I start a recording on this, I just admire what I have built. As ugly as it might be, this is very satisfying uh, of a factory. We're gathering so much stuff, it's insane. Look at this dude. Reinforced iron plate. Look how much I've made already. A hundred. I just got a hundred. Also, I manually made uh, some rotors, so that way I have them in case I need to build anything. But I can pretty much just let this go, uh, collect some biomass, and keep the things flowing. Speaking of which, I think that one's out of power. Anyway, welcome back, everybody, to Satisfactory. Today, I want to focus potentially on building the space elevator, uh, because I believe I have all the resources to be able to do that. I'm confident that I do. Uh, the first thing I want to do, though, is upgrade my biomass and optimize my currently disgusting-looking factory that a lot of you are probably already complaining about, uh, even though I haven't seen your comments yet. They're probably complaints. But we have everything pretty much being automated right now, uh, including reinforced iron plates. Those are coming at a very slow pace. This could potentially pick up if I could somehow uh, feed some of these or have another source. I could just cut this supply off, honestly, and just feed the ingots over here. Because the best way you can look at it is this, because, I mean, they're getting split over here. If they're getting backed up, if they stop, that means you could potentially funnel those elsewhere or build another constructor to build whatever you need. So I could potentially have two constructors uh, at this pace right here and then merge them together to fill this one up so we could have double the amount even though we don't really need it. Look at all these screws. Aha, there we go. Okay, I moved the smelter around, get myself a little room, and now the iron ingots are still being stopped right here. I could split this again. I could feed this somewhere else. Regardless, we got a bunch of iron ingots going out here, merging into this one. And now the flow is way increased. These iron plates should be produced, yes, twice as fast now. And then these can be produced faster. Excellent. Just that tiny tweak made it a little bit more efficient. Anyway, we need to pay attention to unlocking some new stuff. There's a uh, biofuel. There we go. Biofuel. And we also get walls and whatnot, all that extra stuff. Bam. Ready for launch? Launch it out. Watch this beautiful guy fly by. Reached. You have unlocked several structures aimed to provide the first needed to build basic factory infrastructure. Okay, so I'm going to temporarily shut down production and take all the biomass and combine it into better biofuel. And then that biofuel will last a long time. Okay, bucko, let's make this stuff. 242 of them, that's a lot. Now, there's no way to automate this, as far as I know. Uh, I don't think there's anything that can cut down or pick up the leaves, which is not a problem. I don't I don't mind having to do some work. I mean, it's not like I'm the CEO of a company that never steps in and helps out. Oh, right. There's stuff needed. Yeah. Barrel nuts added to object scanner catalog. Barrel nuts. Object scanner catalog. I don't know what that means, but I have more stuff that I need to scan. Give me them slugs. How many slugs do you need? You need one. Okay. There we go. Scan it. This scanning thing is very interesting. I think the object scanner catalog might refer to the actual object scanner. I think I saw in the tier upgrades, but there's all these different ways of obtaining new tech and items. I actually kind of like it. Anyway, let's get back to the biofuel. All right, there we go. That's about 60 biofuel per. I don't know how it's going to do, but hopefully it does well. I don't know. It seems like it's not lasting that much longer. Whatever. That's fine. Regardless. Let's get up top this. I haven't seen it here yet. Yay. Look at my factory, dude. It's so... It's so ugly. It's fine, though. It's fine. We are doing... We are doing work of the assembly gods. Oh, right. I need power for up there. Crap. Oh, right. I need the chainsaw. Where's the chainsaw? Uh, because I, I can cut down... Here we go. Because if I can cut down all this extra bush, do I get biomass from it? And is it a lot? That's the question. There we go. Launch pad. We're unlocking everything. It's fine. How much, uh, how much you got left? 
Oh boy. So it's already went through five. I need to collect some more. Let's explore around this way while this stuff builds up. I honestly don't have much else to do except expand my factory. Also, from what I have learned, that artifact I collected is very rare. Uh, I still have. Wait. Do I still have it? Did it go away? I don't actually remember seeing it. It's probably in there. It is in there. Okay. Summer slop. Summer sloop. <gasps> Ooh, look at that, dude. That's crazy looking. Wait. Oh my god. I thought. Oh crap. I thought it was another one of those artifacts. Thank you for dying. Oh my god. You scared the hell out of me, boy. Uh, stop hitting me with your fireball. Why do you even have that? Green slug. Hello. Actually, I, I just researched you. I should find out what you are. <gasps> it's another one. Oh my god. It's another one. Dude, I, I thought it was rare. It can't be rare. These things are freaking all over the place. All right, guys. Back up. Oh, wait. There's jump pads. I remember. I saw oh my god. Can you please? Oh, there's steps. There's also steps. Please back up. Oh, wait. I'm actually going to die. Yo, I'm not ready for this. I'm not ready for death. Can I eat the slug? Can I eat the meat? I strongly advise you to harvest this specimen. Oh, yes, ma'am. I will get up there right away. Oh, I can climb this. Sick. There it is. Another one. Harvest. I will harvest you. Hang on a second. I'm trying to look at the world here. I'm at a good good vantage point. Hey, the rocket's back. <laughs> I can kind of see Your it. Contract legally compels you. To Shut up. I got it. All right, now I'm trying to hurt myself here. Or die. All right, run! Run! Okay, it's back. How do I make the chainsaw? Hey, power slug complete. Cool. Uh, the crystals on this slug can be harvested and converted into a power shard that functions with current fix-it technology. Several buildings would be capable of performing <gasps> over 100% capacity if infused. The what? I can make everything run faster? Oh my god. Wait a second. Let me make all my bio... Let, let me make my biomass, my biofuel. Wow. 516 biofuel. That's crazy. Okay, so I have to split this one five ways to make sure that I have enough for everything. Because I don't want to stop making wire over there. I'm going to need that for my rocket. Oh, there it is. Overclock production. Dude, let's do that. I need to speed up production bad. I mean, it's not that important. But where do I get my damn... Where do I get my damn... Did I not unlock it? I did unlock it, right? Yeah. Is that stored away in a locker? Prom dumb. I'm dumb. It's because I don't have my uh, workbench down. Hold on. I got this, dude. Don't even worry. Okay. Make a chainsaw. Bam! Okay. So now I put the chainsaw in here. And now I can fight enemies with this thing. <laughs> oh my god. This thing is nuts. Uh, so do I... Jeez, man. That's crazy. I don't know what I- what did I just get? Is it just- does it just clear it up? <gasps> Ooh, we do get biomass from it. Hell yeah, dude. Hell yeah. Oh, yes. Perfect. Okay, so it's not the most impressive thing. I'm- I'm gonna be honest. It's not the most impressive. But against enemies, this is probably dope. I need to find someone to- to kill. Alright, let's go up to, uh, let's put some fuel in the copper place. This will also give me an opportunity to kill something with this. Ha <laughs> ha! What's all the hubbub, bub? I got some fuel for you. Keep it going, buddy. Oh, yeah, I don't even have an... Oh, you guys need to produce that faster, man. Faster. Is there anything holding back production here? There's a lot of copper ingots. That's been built up, though. So I could potentially make another constructor. Just kind of like right here. But yeah, see, it's backing up over here. So I can make this a little bit more efficient. Uh, and take... Where's the logistics? Splitter. And then funnel some of that into this one. And then that will produce, if I select it to make wire, then we'll produce double the amount of wire. Now I just need concrete to make one more uh, tower to give this thing enough power over here. Holy crap, actually, never mind. Cutting down all that stuff gave me so much biofuel. All right, well, everything's gonna be powered for literally eternity. I have three stacks so far of 200 biofuel. 1,020, let's fill her up. 50 plates. Give me those plates, dude. That's insane. All right, turn on the light. It's a bit, it's a bit dim. I don't see any enemies either. It's kind of weird. What is that? Oh, coal. All right, there we go. <laughs> oh my God, I love it. And it's all on its own power grid over here too. This is beautiful. This is beautiful stuff. Oh, biofuel. Uh, take a full stack. 
Nothing's getting stopped up now. It doesn't look like it. No, this one is kind of still. It's pretty much because it's full. Is this one also? Is that? Are you serious? Dude, it's filling up. It's going in way too fast than this thing can produce. I know I can do the slug thing now. Okay, so it looks like it's going to back up anyway. So maybe I should just store it in two different places. This is inefficient, isn't it? Because if it's getting stopped up, that means eventually these are going to get stopped up because it can't hold anymore. Or at least the production side of it, right? Like, uh, yeah, see, it's sitting at, at 14, which means it's not getting pushed fast enough. So we're going to need another storage container, which is I'm fine with. I'm absolutely fine with. So let's actually, um, how can we do this? All right, that's, that's much better. That's much better. I don't know why I was making that more complicated than it was, but that's the price of efficiency, dude. Look at this. It's insane. So I could potentially make three of these constructors and stuff. Okay, let's see how this is doing. See, they're collecting. There's two already in there. None in there, which is fine. One's in there producing. It makes it before the other one gets in there. Okay, so it's a little... It's not as efficient as we would hope. But what we can do to help that out is just... Dude, put some in there. Just put some in there, dude. Let it, let it ride out. And then this should, I, I theoretically, produce the most amount without there being any holdup. Because it's just a constant flow into three separate bins. I could merge all these, right? Oh, wait, I could. Into one bin? What? Oh, my God, it's working. <laughs> ah! Dude, that's crazy. I mean, they're going to stop, but they can fill up. This is fine. And this will all merge in here. <laughs> oh, my God. But I do have two biomass burners over here, so I have to maintain them. But they should last quite a long time. Holy crap. We got our copper wire set up. Beautifully done. I mean, it's kind of ugly, but it works. Okay, that's what matters. See, people are going to be upset. Oh, it's not aesthetically pleasing. It doesn't matter. I get the results, dude. You want to see how much you want to see how much concrete I have? Just by doing what I did, by letting the concrete build up. Look, come check out how much I have. As slow as this is, look. As slow as this is, look at that. That's an insane amount of concrete. All right, we'll do, uh, I, I want to see this speed upgrade real quick. I want to see the overclock production. We have enough to do that. All right, there we go. Launch it. All right, we got two minutes to wait. Uh, I can make some more biomass. <gasps> wait, power shard. There's one right there. Oh, <gasps> okay, but where do I attach this? Is there, is there a slot on these machines that, <gasps> oh my God, there is a slot. There's a slot for it. So what can I... Okay, what does it say? Chris like shard, raise strange power. So can I... Ra oh my god, I can raise it. Okay, but what does that actually do? See, they need screws. The screws aren't coming in fast enough. 7.5 per minute instead of 5. Dude, that's insane. Okay, so do I need to... I need to produce more screws. More screws. We need more screws. Yeah, it's getting stopped up here. So if I can do this and then raise this up. 135 screws per minute. I could make another one. There's a slug up here. I'm gonna, I'm, I gotta test this out, dude. This is nuts. Wait, can I actually get rid of these things with a chainsaw? Nope, it doesn't do anything. God dang it. I'm gonna die. I don't have any food. Crap, I can't get that one. I don't know how I would get up there, I guess jump. Dang it, dude. I really wanted to see what it would do. Have you scanned already? Oh, you're still, you're still doing that. Okay, I need to know. Do I have any more slugs? Oh, I do. I have more slugs than I thought. Oh my God, dude. Let's turn these into power cores. Let's make it happen, Captain. So theoretically, if I can add another power shard over here and have this work even more efficiently, this should run through very quickly. Let's raise this up. 135 to 180. See, the iron rods are still very full. That's the problem here. Oh, so this can't produce it fast enough. I see. Oh, crap. <laughs> I think I might have run out of fuel or overloaded it, but that's fine. We'll put one here and put one here, and then we'll raise this up to supreme amount, which is going to demand a lot of more, lot more power. Yeah, I think uh, I need another biomass burner. Son of a bitch. Okay, those things are working overloaded. It is working... Uh, but it's not doing what I had to add extra screws. The problem is it has to build up the extra screws. And unfortunately, the conveyor belts don't work any faster than this. At least not yet. There probably are faster belts, but I'm not sure if I have access to that or not. Got to get to upgrading. But this is fine. 
this is fine. This will work for now. If I need to overclock anything else, I'll uh, I'll get it working. I promise. Once I'm done with this rocket thing, uh, I'll be making a more efficient looking factory. Right now, we're producing everything we need. Everything we need. All right, so we got the bacon thing. I don't know what it does, but I'll give you this. Emanate alarm or bacon agaric added to object scanner catalog. Cool. There we go. Object scanner nut. I just need some nuts for that one. Mushrooms. Okay, I can do that. I don't know what this does, but let's, uh, I don't know what, what is it? What, what could that possibly do? There we go. Launch that too. And we got nut. Object scanner. Okay. I don't necessarily know what that means, but I guess if I unlock the scanner part, like right here, object scanner. There we go. Launch that one. We'll unlock that. Two minutes till the pod returns. Miles okay. So, given the fact that the belts don't move any quicker to accommodate for the faster production speeds from the cores, I just realized that there's really no point in these having them. So, I might as well just take them out and use them somewhere else. Okay, so this, this isn't the best thing. I should probably speed up maybe concrete, right? Since that seems to be slowing down, we need this to be a little bit faster. Let me uh, utilize this a little bit more simply. Uh, let's put one of these guys there. Raise that up. It's 150. Hopefully it doesn't shut off power. See, the thing is, is it's waiting for three of them to get in. So again, this doesn't really do all that much. It just makes it a little bit faster. I wonder what happens if I put two in. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, Jesus Christ, dude. Scared me. Okay, yeah, the power is being overloaded. That's not good. It's honestly not worth rearranging all this power or adding more power just to have the concrete go a little bit faster. I think I should put it somewhere else to be more useful. Okay, maybe I can do it here at the iron ore. If I just add this one, it'll go from 30 per minute to 45. And then we can do this one. This is probably going to show off the power, but 15 to 22.5, which means this should come out a little bit faster as well. Yep, there goes the power. Son of a bitch. <laughs> Okay, I added all this extra biomass. I need to uh, reallocate some of these. You guys are attached to what? That one? Okay, this is where you guys shine through and telling me that my shit needs more organization. This is just a mess and I hate it already. On? Yes. Rock it out, guys. Come on. So we should be producing iron plates at just a, uh, just a tad bit faster than before. I'm actually curious to see how much wire we have stored in that bin. It's probably full by now. Okay, did the thing return? The thing returned. Good. Jump pads, walkways, none of this stuff is uh, really that important right now. We just need to be able to build the thing. The big old space elevator. Oh my god, wait a second. Oh my god, wait, what? <laughs> this thing is huge! Oh my god! Dude, that's insane! Well, we've accomplished a lot today. I know I said I was going to try to get to the space elevator. But we are. That's our very next step, and I'll save that for the next episode. Hope you guys are enjoying the videos. If you are, you know what to do. I love you all, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye!